FGFA state-of-the-art fifth-generation fighter jet. In 2007, Russia and India signed an agreement to jointly develop the fifth-generation fighter aircraft. The Russian-Indian plane is being developed on the basis of Russia's fifth-generation T-50 PAC-FA, prospective airborne complex of frontline aviation fighter jet in line with India's requirements specification. The Russian-Indian fifth-generation fighter aircraft, FGFA, is being developed in accordance with the program and Russia is fulfilling its obligations, President of Russia's United Aircraft Corporation, UAC. Earlier, the Times of India newspaper reported with reference to a high-ranking official in the Indian Defence Ministry that India was ready to continue developing the fifth-generation fighter aircraft jointly with Russia only if all technologies were transferred. Also, the project is expected to help India develop its own new generation plane. Some media outlets reported later that the project might be postponed due to Russia's unwillingness to transfer all technologies. Russia is complying with the program and fulfilling all our obligations India needed. After a hiatus of nearly a year, India and Russia had in February revived talks on the much-delayed FGFA project after a clearance from Defence Minister. Since then, a lot of issues related to work share, IPR and technology transfer among others have been sorted out between the two sides along with the monetary commitments. In 2010, India had agreed to pay 295 million US dollars towards the preliminary design of the fighter, called in India as prospective multi-role fighter. After under the new offer, India will have to pay about 3.7 billion US dollars, instead of 6 billion US dollars, for the technological know-how and three prototypes of the fighters, defense sources have said. India has a requirement for 120-130 such swing-roll planes with stealth features for increased survivability, advanced avionics, smart weapons top-end mission computers and 360-degree situational awareness. Several things have been resolved but it is critical to assess how we benefit from the program before making the next move. Design issues also have to be looked into, the source said. The Indian Air Force wants the stealth fighter to have a more powerful engine as the existing one doesn't give it super cruise capability. The FGFA project will produce a state-of-the-art fighter jet, and it will be the result of the work on Russia's most modern technology done by both Russian and Indian engineers and constructors. In particular, a two-seat version of the plane will be developed and an advanced engine with increased thrust will be installed under the program India's FGFA. India's Air Force is expected to be the first customer of the fighter jet and then the plane will be delivered to third countries. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.